Stark. I build neat stuff. I got a great girl. Occasionally, save the world. Welcome to Tony's workshop. The great thing about Iron Man 3 is Tony's workshop has every machining tool and every gearhead nerdgasm you could ever want. I'm crazy about this stuff. It's one of the great joys of playing Tony Stark. Robert wants to do a little test run, okay? Eclectic and electric. <laughs> Audi's been with Iron Man since the very first film. So much of his journey over the course of Iron Man 3 is parallel with his car, with his relationship to Audi, and there's a very dramatic scene up front that you've seen in the trailers of his house getting destroyed. Go! There's an incredible scene of his beloved R8 flipping head over tail down into the sea. That is such an identifiable part of his life. And at that part in the movie, we want to take everything important away from him. And it is a lot of fun to see Tony out of his element. His personal journey and the journey of his technology are, I think, second to none. As we develop Tony Stark and as Audi has developed their cars and their campaign, is sort of a lifestyle component. It's the notion of the fantasy brought to life. You know, it's moments like these when I realize what a superhero I am. Wow. Yeah. This is the most emotionally satisfying and the most technically and action-wise and superhero-wise entertaining of them all.